It was the meeting of stalwarts. Modi visits Rajnikanth in Chennai. Both say the meeting is strictly personal, but set political tongues wagging across the country. Modi's visit to Karnataka was no less of a flutter. Modi targets Devagoda for a stunt, says Devagoda can come stay in Gujarat when he becomes Prime Minister. Devagoda reacts to Modi's invite, says he has his own sons to provide for him. More secrets and money tumble out of Babulal's closet. The day after the EC found 9 crore rupees, Kisan Bikash Patra worth 34 crore rupees seized from his office. Tamil Nadu Chief Minister J. Jayalalitha springs a surprise for the first time ever. The Tamil Nadu Chief Minister hits out at the BJP, tells his supporters that the BJP has also betrayed Tamil Nadu like Congress. As she rakes up Kaveri issue yet again but stays mum on good friend Modi. It's Gandhi versus Gandhi and this time around it's the younger plot locking horns. Priyanka says Varun Gandhi is a brother gone astray and asks people to teach him a lesson. Mother reacts, says country will decide who has gone astray. YSR Congress opens a box of promises for voters. In its manifesto, Jagan promises a golden era in both Telugu states. Other welfare and development issues also feature in the list. <laughs> Harshika Poonacha goes an extra mile for BJP, almost forces voters to say they will vote for the party in Gadag. Star campaigns continue while Amrish bats for Nandan Nilakini in Bangalore South. Golden Star Ganesh campaigns for Anand Kumar. Other stars also throw their weight behind candidates across the state. An armed army party goes unique, organizes a flash mob in Breed Road to woo voters. Hundreds of armed army party supporters, along with locks of our candidates, come together for a jig. <laughs>